Now, emotional impact can be a lot more subtle. For example, your mother may say, So, Stanley, have you decided if you could come visit us for the holidays? And it makes you just feel, Oh, God, if I say no, it's going to be this huge hassle. You know, it's just going to be this big argument. And it just makes you want to say yes, just to avoid that hassle. But if she said it more like, so, Stanley, are you going to visit us for the holidays? It makes it a lot easier to say, Oh no, sorry mom, I decided to go to Hawaii instead. Now, also I want to stress that this has only been one example of how to use emotional impact. All the things you've heard have been what I like to call, If you do what I say, we'll be friends. If you don't, we'll be enemies because they make you feel that way inside. They make you feel that if you just agree with the person, then everything will turn out okay. But if you disagree, then bad things will happen. There's other examples of emotional impact. For example, my girlfriend might say to me, um, Stanley, if it's okay, when uh, you get the clothes out of the dryer, can you immediately fold them or hang them up so they don't get wrinkles? And as soon as I hear that pain in her voice, because I really care for my girlfriend, I want to do whatever I can to make her happy. And you can believe that I will remember to fold those clothes or hang them up from then on. But if you just kind of casually tossed it out there and said, oh, hey honey, you know, make sure you fold those clothes. I'll just be like, oh yeah, yeah, sure, whatever. And I may not remember. But we're not going to worry about those other examples of emotional impact in this video. All we're going to focus on is, if you do what I say, we'll be friends. If you don't, we'll be enemies. Because that's the most powerful tool in emotional impact that I could give you right now. So here's the step by step. First, turn your body towards them. If a bullet was to shoot out of your chest, it should hit them. Second, use open body language. Don't cross your arms and try to take up a lot of space. Third, look them in the eye. You don't have to stare them down, but they should look away first. Also, you should always maintain slightly better eye contact than they are with you. Fourth, your voice tone should go down at the end of your sentence. So it should be, Hey you, come here, versus, hey you, come here. Fifth, speak loud, slow, and clearly. This will draw them in and make them fascinated by what you have to say. Six, and probably most importantly, don't laugh nervously, like, <laughs> again, ever, at all. Now, a question I get a lot of times, does this apply to females as well? Yes, all these steps are exactly the same for females. Now, of course your voice is not going to sound exactly like mine, this is a very male sounding voice, but you're still going to do all those steps, like speak loud, slow, and clearly, and go down at the end of your sentence. It'll just be a little different. In fact, the female voice is not that much higher than a male voice on average. Usually it just has less air pushing through, so it doesn't sound as forceful. So whatever your voice is, just speak louder, speak slower and clearer, and go down at the end of your sentence. Great. Do these things all the time. Don't just do it a little once in a while. Incorporate them to every aspect of your life. Notice how much more respect people will give you and notice how much more concern they will be for your feelings. Okay, now I want to tell you what to expect in the future when you start using emotional impact. First, expect to feel a lot of fear and anxiety. Your mind's worried that if you use emotional impact, and you don't just let people walk all over you, then they might get mad and stop being your friend. Now, we know this isn't true, 
but your mind doesn't know it. So your mind gives you fear and anxiety in order to prevent you from using emotional impact. That's okay. Just push through it. Eventually that fear and anxiety will dull and it'll be a lot easier to use emotional impact. Secondly, expect people to start treating you differently right away. They're going to be a lot more accommodating to your needs. It's going to go something like this. You're going to say something like, Hey, Stanley, you didn't call me back. When you do that, it's a waste of my time and it makes me not want to hang out with you. I just go, yeah, man. Yeah, sure, whatever. Like he's instantly going to act differently and it's going to be completely surprised because you're not being your usual meek and passive self. In fact, it'd probably be a lot of fun to watch if you weren't feeling so anxious at the time. Third, expect them to test you. They may just throw out a comment like, Gee, Stanley, you've really been acting differently lately. Okay, what's going on here is that they kind of want to make you feel a little bit uncomfortable. They kind of want to make you think to yourself, Oh, hmm, maybe I should pull back on that emotional impact stuff. Maybe I've been doing it too much. Okay, don't do that. These tests are meant to make sure that you've actually changed instead of just faking it. The way to pass them is just keep using the emotional impact as much as you're using it. In fact, take these tests as a sign that you're on the right path and doing the right thing. Okay, great. So start using emotional impact immediately in every aspect of your life. And if you like this type of stuff and you want to stop being suicidal quickly, I highly suggest you sign up for my free newsletter. In this free newsletter, which goes out two or three times a week, I teach you great tools, incredible techniques, and step-by-step -step instructions for how to get out of pain, gain friends, and essentially have a happy life. In fact, this video is one of the things that people in my free newsletter get, and it's not even the best stuff they get. They get better things than this. So if you want to sign up for my free newsletter, go to stopsuicidalsuffering.com forward slash newsletter, or just click the link below this video.